Oi! It's me, Omega Wolf Light. Welcome back to the Blade Chronicles 2. Let's get back into this. I'm gonna try to make this a short episode this time, guys. And sorry if I'm a little loud. Oh yeah, we gotta do some cooking time with Pyra. Do 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 do. Cooking with Pyra. The best show on TV. Let me look out. Alright. I'll make some food. I mean, Pyra's making food because she offered. I just got to guide her there. Alright. You ready, Pyra? Get to work. I just thought of a great menu idea. Look forward to that later. I thought it'd be a cutscene or something like that. Uh, let's see what we got. Can I make this? Not enough. Ah, uh, so this is the only thing we can make? Fine. Oh, man. This is delicious. Oh, yum, yummy. So super very tasty. Simply exquisite. I haven't eaten this well in a hundred and twenty years. Glad you liked it. It seems like I did okay. I was worried I'd have gotten a little rusty over the years. It didn't taste rusty at all. Uh, um, I mean... <laughs> Tora is curious. Pyra is fire using blade, yes? When Tora broke that water pipe, Pyra could still make fire. Come to think of it, you're right. That Bridget, the Imperial Blade, she used fire abilities just like Pyra, but the water seemed to douse much of her strength. So, what are you saying? This world full of elemental energy called ether, yes? Ether comes in forms like fire, water, and wind. While battling, drivers and blades both draw power from ether. But fire not good with water. Other blade woman got splooshy with water, so fire powers all damp. But Pyra and I were able to use our powers with no problem. Indeed. They were unaffected. Why? Um, well, my powers don't come from fire. Meh meh? If powers not fire, why look like flames? That may be a little complicated to explain. Go on then. Tora like complicated things a lot. Not me. I like simple. Well, um, I, uh, 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 it. Knock it off, Tora. Can't you see you're making her uncomfortable? Eh. Everyone has things they'd rather not talk about. Right? I'm sorry. I'm sure. I'll be able to tell you about it soon enough. Don't worry about it. Right now, we need to think about how to rescue Nia. First, we go around town and find all information we can. Hmm. Yes, I dare say that we're all wanted criminals by this point. Pyra sticks out like a sore thumb. I'm so sorry. Don't worry, friends! Oh. <laughs> Tora has an idea! You just need a disguise, Pyra. At least this guy's better not be stupid. Special Inquisitor Morag! To what do we owe this extreme pleasure? Had we but heard of your grace's visit, we could have prepared a suitable... I don't stand on ceremony, Consul. I'd rather you just did your job. Y your grace? Someone of your standing deserves to be treated as such. You are his majesty's representative. Please permit us to lay on a meal befitting your grace. Until then, we would be honored if... You made impressive time. I wasn't expecting you until tomorrow. Oh, oh, oh Lady Bridget! If we have found the Aegis, then there is no time to waste. But I fear the passage has taken its toll on our engines. The Aegis? How do you? 
Is there a problem, Dougal? N uh, not at all, Your Grace. Good. Oh no. Now, you've captured a driver from Torna. I am going to speak with her. What? Uh, why do you want... Dougal. I don't remember asking for your opinion. Y yes, Your mm. Grace. I'll take you to her right away. She's not tied up or anything. Hm. So, you are the Torna Ruffian. I must say you look a little different from your poster. A little different. Whoever drew that should be the one in jail. <laughs> yes, I would be angry too. You can drop the friendly act. You won't name your friends? My friends? I'm not so sure I'd call those trigger happy Torna goons friends. I see. I think we have our wires crossed here. I am not talking about Torna. Huh? You're not? No. I was referring to your more recent traveling companions. The driver boy and his blade. Rex and Pyra. Well... That was easy. Damn it! <laughs> nice going. I don't trust her. But I trust... I have mixed feelings about her. What on earth? This looks like it could actually work. Good idea, Tora. Right! Let's look for the lens of Rex Rex! Why on earth did he have an outfit like that? That fit her too? That's suspicious. Um, why would he have an outfit like that that fits her as well? It's human shaped and it fits her. Does she look better with the outfit on? I don't know. Is it saved? I can't tell, does she look better with this outfit or not? She looks good with the outfit on, but she also looks good with it off. I'm going to suggest she looks good in anything. Um, it's hard to tell. I actually want to say she looks better with that outfit on. Minus the ears. But at the same time, it's hard to tell. Okay, so where am I supposed to be going? I, uh... I would say she actually looks better with the outfit on, but I'm going to go on a limb and say that's debatable collection point. What have we here? Mom, wood, 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 wood. Gotta get that wood. Ah. Uh, Internet, don't you dare make that joke. I actually think Pyra looks better with that on right now. Right now. But I think she looks good in anything. <laughs> so, f right now, I... <laughs> For the current situation, she looks good in that. That's what I'm going to say. But I'm going to bet the situation changes. Oh, this is how I get out. I thought I could get out by, you know, climbing the ladder. Can she climb? Can you climb? Or is it just me that can do that? Oh, wait. Why shouldn't I get a disguise, too? Because they know what I look like. I guess not. Um, so he only had one outfit that's human size, and it, and it only fits a girl. Why on earth did he have a outfit like that is what I'm wondering. Hello? What are you? How do I get down? Because that looks main quest like. 
Are you taking this boat? That's right. It's sunset. I can't play Big Bro as a driver now! That means he has to go to more Adrian, right? It's gonna be lonely without him, but I'll be fine. I'll give him tons of advice before he left. You can make sure he stays close to his blade when he fights. He needs to do that because that's how you deepen your affinity with your blade. And when your affinity deepens, he gets stronger and so does your blade. You'll do well to remember that too. Really? Oh, he's talking to me? My big bro, my big bro became a driver and went off to more Adrian. Wow, pretty impressive. He said he's going to earn bucket loads of cash. Only if only I uh, had stayed here with us. Is your brother your only family? No, it can't be. I've got a big brother called Jock. He and he became a driver. And guess what? He's got into the Adrian army. And what weapon does Blade have again? Uh, if it was a great axe or a mega axe, he can smack the bad guy super easily. But it's dangerous too, because if you deal that much damage all once, they'll get really angry at you. If it was a bit ball, he'd be able to heal injured teammates. Bit balls are good at doing that. If he's got teammates with a shield hammer or a crow or a katana, though, he needs to pay attention to their HP. See, I know so. That's because me and Jack study together. Big brother! Well, you're big. But no, I think that's the brother. Since he's in the army now, and I'm wanted by the, the their army now, that would make him a threat now, right? Uh, I hope I don't have to fight him one day, because... Uh... Hi, Lobe. Have you heard anything about a girl called Nia who was captured by the Adri Adrian... Adrian... <laughs> the Empire recently? I'm going to call them that, because they're part of an empire. Just to save... Make things easier on me. Oh yeah, I heard about that. Some Adrian dude was saying they were going to execute the prisoner within the next few days. Some of guys are pretty bad, right? I heard they killed all the drivers to steal their core crystals. What? Amazing if the Empire have really captured one of them. The Empire is so cool. Sorry to burst your bubble, kid. You don't even know what execution is. Pirate, what are you doing? I wonder what they'll, what they'll do at this execution thing. Anyway, I've never seen one before. I gotta go see for myself. You guys should come along too. Uh, thanks. You don't know, uh, kid, I don't think you want to see this. It isn't all fun and games. You think an execution's like a festival? Uh, no, it isn't. They're not going to be playing games and stuff like that. Or else do I need to go up? Up. When did it get so late? Oh, and I've started glowing. I'm a bit self-conscious. I just realized. Maybe we should have got an outfit that went, co went covered, but went all the way down to our ankles. Because you glow at night. Sure. It's only your ankles are glowing now because the rest is covered, but... You're still glowing. So, they would have to look at your bottom half to know it's you, but... Maybe we should have found a longer outfit. Maybe I can just rest here. Oh, wait. I can't rest. I said in a couple days they're going to execute her. I don't have time to rest. I guess we'll have to walk around while you're glowing. Wait, I wonder if the brother's still there at night. I want to check. Yeah. Great, she's glowing. So as long as no one looks at her... Where does it go? Pyra, get down here. I need to check where you're glowing. Okay, as long as no one looks at her ankles or her thighs, we're good. But that's going to be hard. If there's anyone in here that's into someone like her, they're clearly going to notice the glowing. 
endless. Huh. Okay, that's that way. What's this way? I just hope no one here is into Pyra. Because if that happens, they're going to take notice of our assets. Including the assets that are glowing. Okay, wrong word. Only one of those are an asset. But either way, if someone starts hitting on her, there's a good chance they're gonna look at her eyes and notice the glowing. Hopefully, they, whoever, hopefully anyone that falls for her won't know about the aegis. So, you know, there's dead sparkly spots when you're walking around outside. That's where my favorite bugs are. Well, sometimes in case you can catch fish. Are you tired, Pyra? Or pick veggies from them as well. Oh, and also if you have a blade who knows their stuff. Oh, it's time to end the episode, damn it. You can get a lot more than you normally do. I guess it's because they're showing you how to do it properly. I want my friends with a blade who knows a lot about bugs and stuff, so I can go bug hunting. How on earth did you... I'm not gonna ask, not gonna ask. Where else do we need to go? Probably over there. But I really want to see what this is. Pyra, stop jumping off the rails! I feel like a babysitter. It's the tree! Can I zoom in? No. Damn it. What a very nice picture. Can I go in? No, I can't. Let's be an idiot and jump! How about no? Don't you dare jump! Got it, Pyra! No jumping! So yeah, sorry if my timer went off and that got in the video. I thought I had my phone muted. I decided I'll make this video longer. Uh, this was probably a bad idea. Pyra? Oh, so she just spawns when I do that. Bridge time! We need to find people, they're further up. Resident, really, really loud, this is where the people live. Haha! -ha! Hana, Hana, come to the city on vacation. It's a very nice and lively place. Hana, Hana, also see. Beautiful scene on way here to here. Driver was lending hand to other driver who fell down, getting them back on feet. If comrade fell in battle, lend helping hand to help recover. Such beautiful bond of friendship. More pretty, pretty than prettiest arty pictures. Thanks for sharing the other day. Don't mention it. What are you talking about? Can I do it? Can I do Ah. Oh, why well, visit a driver just who I was hoping to see? Something wrong? Well, you see, I've got loads of fruit now thanks to this bumper harvest. I just think I'd use it to make my famous fruit pie. Everyone gets a slice. I don't mean to break, but everyone who tries my pie says it's unspecial. Yes, ask anyone. Twine as pie, the tastiest and all. Tarry God. My husband nearly burst me <laughs> stuff <laughs> It was because my pie's out he wanted to marry me, he said. Oh, I'm sorry, I got a little bit carried anyway, blowing my own trumpet here. So the problem is I'm actually a bit short of some things I need for my pie. The traders around here are hopeless for ingredients, so I was hoping some kind person would get them for me. Shall we get to work on this right way? You want Mr. Power? I'm up to any challenge. That's very kind of you. A nice bit of hustle, Heineken's... Uh, I don't know where to get those. Can I get to them around here? Anywhere? Or not? Can I get them anywhere around here? It doesn't look like it. Oh, I... 
You know what? Uh, rescuing uh, Nia is probably more important. Yeah, let's go back to the main story. The main story quests are probably a bit more important. I moved my family here from Marjorie because I heard it was a really safe place to live. A fight between those Torna terrorists and Marjorie's final place is exactly not what I signed up for. I just want my life one daughter to have a peaceful life, but at this rate it seems this isn't. That's not good. Yeah! Nia's not Nia's not bad. Hope all this gets sorted out sorted out sooner rather than later. Feels like the whole city on edge. You do realize I was the one fighting your blade. And that was only because <laughs> you stupid soldiers started it. 